sounds like some old technological rebel. There is nothing of interest here. Master Wilhelm and some newcomers. What brings you to me? It's good to see you too, Oropin. We just spoke to Lucio. He said you had some tools for us. Ah, those tools he asked me to acquire were for you. Here they are. It wasn't easy finding anything of Sundarian make out here, you know. Luckily for you, I'm something of an expert in the matter. I have a lot of connections. I'm a lot more than just an expert on the ancient Rena, you know. Wow! Thank you, Mr. Oropen. Let's hurry up and take these back to Mr. Rohan. I'm sure he'll be delighted. I hope the new tools prove helpful. Also, don't let Lucio forget, he owes me a favor. Hmm. Yeah? Are you always looking at those papers? He's always been like that. Hmm? Do you have anything important to say? Well, we actually found something, and we thought you could help us out. Where did you get that? Yeah, yeah. This is the same ruler I used to have when I was young. Mother gave it to me. I remember I promised her that when I grew up, I would become a great architect and would help keep the kingdom in a marvelous state. It's never too late, Oropen. Hmm, you may be right. I should honor her memory and fulfill my promise to her. I'll start right away! That's the spirit, Four Eyes. Master, do you know where I should focus? If there's any place in Talira that requires renovation, it would be the Cathedral. Hmm, the Cathedral. Yes, yes, it is mainly constructed with salt. Give me some time. I need to think this through thoroughly. your stolen tools, but we managed to find you some new ones. Where did you find these? They're of Sindarian origin and very high quality. We did a favor for a friend, and he was able to track them down for us. Do you think they'll work? Oh, yes. These will definitely get the job done. So you'll fix the shattered mural? My word is my bond. Let's go take a look at it. We'll meet you in the cathedral beneath the salt mines. Hmm, I've got it! Hmm, I need to research more deeply into it. You all go and get me some samples from the mines. I need enough for me to conduct the initial research. Whoa, sure, boss. No time to lose! This is truly important! At least he seems more confident. Sure. Let's head out to the salt mines. We still have to search for said samples. Welcome. A warm bed for everyone? It's only 200 marbles for the room. That would be great. At your service. Come with me. I'm not running a charity here. It would be great if we could travel by water. That poor mural really got smashed up. Wait a moment. Have you seen this mural before, Miss Buki? Have I? Oh, yes, I have. Yes, 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 yes. I, I saw it before. And there was a tall bird, 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 bird lady, too. 
A tall bird lady. Wait a second. Do you mean Rollis? Yes. Uh, no? I th think, think, th think, think so. I'm sorry, dearie. But, but, but my memories are still all fuzzy. How very interesting. Let's keep an eye on this. Whew, you were right. Someone did quite a number on this thing. Do you think you'll be able to repair it? I told you before, girl. I can fix anything. Not that I doubt your skill as an artisan, but... This mural is special. You may be able to fix the physical structure of it, but the colors that make up the images are no ordinary dyes. They require certain rare minerals. They are quite hard to get. Hmm, I see. Yeah, that might pose a small problem. It'll be okay. You can leave that part to us, Mother Superior. Are you sure, Master Wilhelm? It is a dangerous journey. I'm sure. Wait for us here, Rojo. We'll bring you back the minerals for the dyes. Maestro, what did you just agree to? North of here, there's a place called Rainbow Lake. It's a collection of mineral springs with unusual magical properties. We can get the minerals we need for the dyes from there. But the only way to get to the lake is via the river. So how do we get there? What about asking Paulina? She got us across the ocean. How much trouble could a river be? Wow. Did you take your brain out of storage just for this occasion? Yeah, yeah. Get a step stool and come say that to my face sometime. Let us go ask Paulina then. Master Wilhelm, it's so good to see you again. Oh, Master Wilhelm, welcome. What can I do for you? Sorry to disturb you. I was hoping you could take a look at something. Oh, where did you find this book? Do you recognize it? I do. This was Gladys's diary. But I thought it had been left to Arvo and Irva, the twins. The twins? Indeed. That's why I wondered where you found it. I assumed they would have kept it safe. We found it inside the museum. Destroyed. I see. And you found it... burned? What is it? It's Arvo and Irva. I'd heard they were asking about the Forbidden Collection at the University. Specifically, about the Unknown Arts. The Unknown Arts? Forbidden magic. Necrotic magic. Magic that plays with the life force of others, binding it to use in twisted ways. Like bringing the dead back to life. Why would they try and burn it? A sacrifice, perhaps? A powerful connection to a powerful spirit? Or just to change its appearance. More importantly, how do we open it? Only in a very peculiar way. You need Gladys's ring to open it. Gladys never preferred traditional methods. I would suggest you look at the university. Maybe you can find some clue as to what they might have learned. That's not much to go on. It's all we have. Thank you, Mother Superior. I hope you manage to find what you're looking for, Master Wilhelm. So we're looking for clues? Yes! Yell if you see a large box labeled clues. That'll be it. Let's search around. What's this? A projector. Could be worth watching. <sighs> Not in its current state, though. Matthias? Leave it to me. Perfect state as expected. Let us return it to the present. A projector with Gladys's image. A hologram. 
A recording from the past. Of Gladys and the twins, it appears. Activate it! Activate it! So there you go. Do you have the ring? Huh? It appears it's been partially corrupted. Where did you put the book, Irva? I hid it in the museum, idiot. No one will look for it there. Are you sure? Pretty sure. Besides, after I burned it, it looked like every other piece of old trash. What about the ring? You'll love this. What? You know the statue in the middle of the plaza? Obviously. I stuck it in a small hole under one of the pillars. No one is going to find it there. Nice. Huh? Wait, we left this thing on. The projection ends there. So the ring is in the statue in the middle of town? That doesn't seem too difficult. Let us go, friends! to try again today. They're my children. I can't give up. I'll get through to them, no matter what it takes. I had another discussion with Arvo and Irva today, although it turned into more of a fight, to be honest. I tried to talk to them, but they just wouldn't listen. Still, I've got to find a way to get through. I'm at my wit's end. I'm not entirely sure what to do. I think... I think I'm going to try putting them in charge of the new renovation fund I'm establishing. Maybe if they see for themselves how our money is improving the city, it will change their perspective. I told Arvo and Irva about the fund. For the first time in a long time, they didn't argue. Maybe we are making progress. Seems like their relationship was bumpier than they let on in public. I agree. This probably wasn't the end of their troubles. So, what should we do now? Perhaps we should speak with the Mother Superior again. And tell her we were able to open the diary. Master Wilhelm, did you manage to find a way to open the book? Indeed. We found the ring and managed to open it. Wonderful. But could I trouble you with something else? Of course. Could you give me that book, please? Huh? That book is the last memory of my dear friend Gladys. I would like to keep it in honor of her. I suppose it's for the best. You can have it. Oh dear. Thank you. I want you to have this. Perhaps you'll find greater use for it. I guess that's all we're going to learn from the book. Yes. Let's resume following our other priorities. any new clothes while you were in Nevitalira, did you? Oh, no. We, um, ran into some problems, actually. Would you mind doing us another favor? Anything for you, my little peach. 
We have to travel down the river to reach the Rainbow Lake. Hmm. I don't think I could make it past the mountains. At least not anytime soon. But it's just a river, you said? Maybe you can use my shoe. It's big enough to carry you and exquisitely made, so it won't weigh you down. Make sure to bring it back, though. I do hate to lose anything stylish. Thanks, Paulina. Oh, and one other thing. Do you happen to recognize Buki here? She seems to have lost her memory. Hmm, let me look at her. Oh, hello there, there, there. G -g 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 Good morning, sweetie. Aren't you a lovely one? I've never seen one of our kind dressed so... nicely. Unfortunately, as you can s s s see, I'm not in any condition to be pu pu putting out re refreshments. She seems familiar, but I'm sorry, my darling. I honestly can't remember much. That's okay. Thanks anyway, Miss Paulina. Everyone, let's go try out this shoe. Seems like you can use the shoe here. Do you want to use it? Sure. Do you want to land here, Crispo? Yes, this is the right place. Seems like you can use the shoe here. Do you want to use it? Sure. Do you want to land here, Crispo? Yes, this is the right place. lake later in the year. We'll need to visit each pool to collect all the minerals we need. Be careful though, these pools have some magical properties. Sometimes, when a talented time mage comes here, they react in surprising ways. I remember when I first came here and... never mind. Let's just go. Crispel, what do you want to do? I want to record our progress.
Here it is. The first pool. Crispell, why don't you collect a sample for Rojo? But be careful. The pool may react to you. Okay. It's the orphanage in Nareen. Empty and abandoned after some disaster. The pools seem to be reflecting your sight. For once, we can all see what you see. I remember seeing this before. This was my first real vision. I was so scared and confused. Hey, this future's not gonna happen. I promise. We are likely to see more visions as you visit the other pools. Have you finished collecting the sample? Oh, yes. I bottled up some of the mineral water. On to the next one, then. That statue has been sitting there for as long as I can remember. I think it may be another one of the witnesses. But I've never seen it move. He looks so f f f f f familiar Oh, I wish, wish I could remember. Well, perhaps it will start moving soon. Stranger things have happened on this journey of ours. I doubt it, but I suppose anything is possible.
We've arrived at another pool. Be careful, Chris Bell. Here I go. I see two strange people talking to each other. Oh, look, my, 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 my children. Your children? You mean those people in the white coats? Who are they? Hmm. Dearie me. Those are... R r r r researchers, I th th think. I'm sorry, sweet, sweet, sweetie. My mind isn't what it used to be. I'm so confused. I think we all are. But she doesn't seem to remember anymore. Well, we have collected the mineral water. Let us move on to the next pool. Isabel, what do you want to do? I want to record our progress. Here it is. The third pool. What is this? It looks like two monsters fighting. How bizarre. Why would you be seeing this? I don't know. What a strange vision. I guess we shouldn't worry about it for now. I finished collecting the mineral water. Then let us move on to the next pool. Beautiful. I love the colors. The healing properties of the waters of this place are incredible. I know they're used for a multitude of things, including things that I have in stock. Besides, they're great for dogs. Hannah's fur looks dazzling. Legend. Oh, I've heard of this one. He's one of the warriors who died fending off the Empress. I think he was the one who was supposed to have struck the final blow. He lost his life in the exchange. Old legends. Nothing more. Have you collected the mineral water yet, Chris Bell? Yes, Maestro. I have it. Let's go then. There's still one more pond to visit. And it is by far the most potent.
flower I see growing above the pond? Yes, we call it the Millennium Flower. It's been here for ages, absorbing minerals from the pool. As a result, it's almost overflowing with magical power. The flower grows very slowly, but it's actually older than me. <laughs> like that saying much. No one asked for your opinion, Lunch for Brains. That will be enough, both of you. We are here to collect the mineral water. On to the last pool.